Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, oh my god, in today's video, magpapaganda ulit tayo, but kailangan heat proof, sweat proof, bullet proof, proof 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 proof, lahat ng proof. Kailangan ganon yung makeup natin, mga ganitong tag. Oh my god, ang ganda ganda. Lahat ng mga gagamitin kong products, I tried and tested ko na. So, I know they will last all day, every day. I will list all of the products that I use below on the description box kung interested kayo sa mga ginamit ko. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I hope you learned a lot from it. Kahit mga simpleng bagay lang. So, without further ado, let's go! So, dahil in today's video is yung bulletproof makeup, hindi naman bullet, heat proof, mga ganun ganun. I busted all of the products that I really trust when it comes to hot weather. Nandito lahat ng products na try and tested ko na kahit ang init ng panahon, nagsistay pa rin. Guys, first and foremost, naglalagay ako ng alcohol before ako mag-makeup. Always, always do that. Kahit sanitizer, basta kailangan clean hands. Tapaka important na malena sa ayon ka mai ganar yan kasi kakatapos ko lang maligo at ayoko na mga germs na babalik sa aking mukha you probably heard this grabe hindi ako kapag film kasi kanina ng umaga pa sila pok pok pizza pok pok doon please let me film please you probably heard this a lot of times na it's very important to prime. Prime, prime, prime. Noon, nung hindi pa ako ganun ka mahilig sa foundation, yung mga technicalities ng makeup, hindi talaga ako nagpa-primer. But nung nagsimula na akong gumamit ng primer, doon ko napatunayan kung gano'n ka-importante ang primer, you guys. It makes a big difference. So, grab your primer. Any primer will do. Basta try and tested nyo na. Yung sa akin, yung gagamitin kong primer is the Bello BB Cream. BB Cream BB Cream. Ah. BB Cream. <laughs> BB Cream siya, pero pwede siyang maging primer. And I really love this, guys. Like, I really, really love this. On days na ayoko mag-foundation, ito talagang nilalagay ko. Hindi ko pinapowderan kasi it's very good for the skin. It's like a skincare na. Make sure na yung paglalagyan yun ng primer is yung parts na marami kayong pores kasi yun yung parts na madali tayong mag-oil up. So, in my case, dito sa cheeks, ko yung pinakamaraming pores. Hindi naman sila sobrang laki guys, but marami sila dito. I think yun lang. Yun, dito lang talaga yung maraming pores guys. Kaya dyan talaga ako nagsisimula. So, since clean na yung hands natin, we can go ahead and blend using our fingers. Ay, grabe. Gusto, gusto ko talaga tong BB cream na to. Para na siyang cream guys na skincare, na primer, na BB cream. Hindi ko siya ilalagay dito kasi medyo dry yung mga sides ng face ko. Pagkatapos ng primer, proceed na tayo sa foundation. And guys, ang pinaka the best na na-try ko talagang foundation is yung Revlon. As in, I know marami YouTubers ang nagre-rave nito kasi it's definitely good guys. It's heat proof. Nakalagay dito 24 hour wear but hindi ko to na-try ng 24 hours. But it will really last the whole day kahit anong gawin mo. Kahit mainitan ako ng buong araw, pak na pak pa rin siya as in. This is for combination or oily. Marami ding nagtatanong sa akin sa mga vlogs kung anong suot kong foundation. If nag-foundation ako nung araw na yan, ito yung gamit ko. My shade is 180 Sand Beige. This is definitely bulletproof, heatproof, sweatproof, proof, 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 proof. So, maliit lang ginagamit ko guys kasi alam niyo naman ako, ayoko nung parang Pak, grabe ang makeup, ganon. Ayoko yung sobrang makapal na funda. So, maliit lang ginagamit ko. Ganyan lang talaga. Again, magsisimula ako kung nasan yung malalaking pores ng aking mukha. Ang mga kanyon sa aking mukha at dito yon. Ayan, lalagay ko siya dyan. Normally guys, I dot my foundation sa areas na I really need the coverage. So, dyan. Dito sa under eyes, grabe ang under eyes ko ngayon no, as in, sobrang tagal na kasi namin matulog kakapanood ng Walking Dead. Normally, ito yung ginagawa ko sa center of my face, then I blend my way out. So, in blending my foundation guys, I always, always use a sponge. It's the real technique sponge that I'm currently using kasi sobrang, sobrang malaking difference ang nagagawa niya. Mas flawless, mas smooth, walang streak marks, mga ganun-ganun. I definitely recommend using a sponge 
over a brush. And then, para mas ma-prolong din yung foundation, gumagamit ako ng setting spray. Basa na to ng tubig, but nilalagyan ko pa rin siya ng mist and set kung gusto ko talaga bulletproof yung makeup ko. And then, as usual, start on the center of your face. By the way guys, pag naglalagay ako ng foundation, I do not drag it. I dab. I dab the sponge onto my face and then blend my way out pa ganyan. And then sa forehead guys, pataas na direction. Like, hindi pa baba pa ganun. Ayan, as you can see, very light lang yung coverage niya, but na even out yung skin tone ko. And that's what I'm going for for every day, you know? And then I'll proceed with concealer. Normally on an everyday, hindi ako nagko concealer, but since I still have my acne marks, sometimes I feel the need to conceal them. So I'm using the NYX Conceal, Correct, and Contour Palette. I really like this kasi nagsistay din siya all day, every day. And full coverage to na concealer, guys. So you don't really need a lot of it. So I'm mixing two colors to get my shade. And then I just use my fingers. And then since medyo dark yung under eyes ko ngayon, ewan ko bakit. <laughs> Sobrang late na kung natutulo, guys. As in like mga 5 a.m. na. So I'm gonna use this yellow tone concealer for my under eyes. Maganda to yellow kasi hindi lang siya pang highlight. Kasi hindi lang siya pang conceal but pang highlight na din. For concealers guys, it might take you a long time to find the perfect concealer that will work for your skin type. Kasi ako, I'm very oily. I'm very very oily na most of the concealers na natry ko na nag-crease talaga in the middle of the day. But this one, hindi. And also, it would definitely help if you will try to bake your concealer right after putting it on your under eyes. So, trial and error lang yan, guys. Makikita at makikita nyo rin yung foundation, yung concealer, yung powder na magwa-work sa inyo. Guys, let me tell you, kahit parehos tayong oily, hindi pa rin talaga parehos yung mga products na magwa-work sa atin. I tell you that. Ayan, so I'm done with my base. I'm gonna go ahead and powder. And this powder na feature ko na to sa foundation routine ko. Tried and tested ko na rin to. This is the e.l.f. Translucent Powder. I never expected this powder to work on me kasi it's only 3 bucks. Napoprolong niya talaga and hindi ako mabilis mag-oil up as in. Uunahin kong iset yung under eyes. Gagamitan ko lang yung sponge na kasama. Sobrang gamit na gamit siya kaya maubos na siya. I will also put powder in the center of my face and also sa mga parts na nilagyan ko ng concealer. Okay, so we're done. We're finally done with the base. Let's proceed to contour. I know hindi ko to madalas gawin sa channel ko kasi again hindi ako ganon ka technical sa makeup. Kung ano lang yung gusto ko gamitin that day yun lang yung gagamitin ko. But in today's video gusto ko full on makeup tayo like lahat ng makeup gagamitin natin. I will be using this NYX. Blush. Yes, it's a blush. It's in the shade Taupe. Cool tone siya na gray something, guys. I chose this kasi yung mga NYX blushes ko, guys. Kahit mag-oil na yung mga dito ko, grab din na yung oil, mga ganyan-ganyan, hindi talaga siya nawawala as in. And then, dito ko siya ilalagay. Yung contour, guys, magsisimula siya dito sa my ear. It should end at the tail of your eyebrows. Para sa mga kapwa kong mabilog ang mukha, <laughs> mag-contour na rin tayo dito guys. You should not put your contour here ha, dito sa ibaba. Because we will be creating like a shadow. Hindi ako mahilig mag-contour ng nose guys, but pwede nyo rin itong gamitin contour para sa nose. Ayan, I'm done contouring, so blush na tayo. And again, I will be using the NYX blush in the shade Spice. Itong pinili kong blush sa lahat ng blush ko guys, kasi again, the NYX blushes are really good. Great. Kahit anong gawin mo, kahit mag-ano ka dyan, kahit mag-tumbling-tumbling ka dyan, hindi siya mawawala. So, just a little bit kasi sobrang pigmented nito. My God. Since mabilog yung mukha ko, I drag the blush upwards para medyo ma-lift na rin yung mukha ko. Minsan, hindi rin ako nag-highlight guys kasi medyo over the top na siya. Pero pag gusto ko mag-highlight, very trusted ko na yung Jaclyn Hill Champagne Pop from Becca Cosmetics. Kung bulletproof lang ang labanan guys, packaging palang bulletproof na. 
pero unfortunately nasira <laughs> kasi nahulog ko siya. So I'm just gonna take a little bit of this kasi sobrang pigmented nito guys. Like kung usapang pigmented lang, eto na. Grabe guys, grabe talaga to guys. Kaya hindi ko matapon-tapon, ang mahal pa. <laughs> hindi ko siya nilalagay dito kasi marami akong pores. Oh, diba? <laughs> My god, it's highlight though. And I use a fluffy brush. Hindi ako gumagamit ng dense brush kasi medyo na fo focus siya sa isang part. Ayoko nun. Then a little bit on my nails. A little bit on my cupid's bow. Okay, kilay na tayo. I've featured this on my favorites. It's the NYX Tame and Frame Tinted Brow Pomade in the shade Blonde. Gabi, guys. Bulletproof din nito, guys. Bulletproof hit prop. Kung wala na ganong product sa brush, I proceed with the inner corner. Sa eyes naman tayo. Normally, hindi ako naglalagay ng eyeshadow, but since full-on makeup tayo, guys, itatoda na natin to. So, for eyeshadow, we also need a primer. So, I'm using the e.l.f. primer. Mura lang to, as in like $1 lang siguro to sa website nila. The eyeshadow that I will be using is the Carly by Bell palette. And I will be using this brown color. And guys, natutunan ko sa kaibigan kong baklang makeup artist, pag naglalagay ng eyeshadow, do not really go for the cat eye, lalo na pang everyday. No, just follow the natural shape of your lids, like pa concave. Ganun. And then, to make our eyes pop, lalo na sa mga hooded eyelids, katulad ng sa akin, gumamit kayo ng shimmery eyeshadow sa inner parts or sa center of your lens. And then, I'll get this color. It's the darkest shade. Ilalagay ko siya under my, under my, under my eyes as close to the lash line as possible. Okay, tapos na tayo sa eyeshadow. So, let's proceed with eyeliner. I prefer liquid eyeliners than gel eyeliners, you guys. Kasi nag-crease sa akin or nag-smudge sa akin yung mga gel eyeliner. So, I will be using the BH Cosmetics Liquid Eyeliner in the shade Noir. After the eyeliner, proceed with the mascara, guys. So, hindi ako gumagamit na waterproof na mascara, but I trust this mascara, hindi siya nagbabudge kahit hindi siya waterproof. Kahit anong mangyari, hindi siya nag-smudge. Okay, we're finally done with the face, the eyes, and everything. So, lips na lang. For days na ayaw ko ng touch-ups in the middle of the day, I go for the liquid lipstick from Colourpop kasi it's bulletproof. Bullet prop, sweat prop, hit prop, lahat ng prop. Hindi tama tatanggal. Okay, guys, we're done. We're done, 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 done. Ito na yung finish look natin. Ayan, it's very simple. It's very simple to recreate. So, I'm sure magagaya nyo rin to. Yeah, ito yung makeup na bulletproof, na heatproof, na sweatproof, lahat ng proof. Hindi tama tatanggal sa yung mukha. I know, mag-oil up pa rin ako, but the products that I use will definitely control my oil. So, the products will prevent my face from oiling up that fast. But before I say goodbye, uh, before I say goodbye to you guys, I want to do a Q&A on my channel, my first Q&A, na lahat ng questions galing sa inyong lahat. So please drop me comments below para ma-feature ko kayo sa next video which is the Q&A. I hope you guys like this tutorial and I hope may natutunan kayo kasi yan talaga yung gusto kong mangyari. May matutunan kayo galing sa akin kahit mga simpleng bagay lang. <laughs> so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to leave your questions below and I'll see you soon. Kailangan right, okay. mong tuwan ka ng do your best. Kailangan. Oh, beside. <laughs> oh my god! This thing. <laughs> okay, very good.